Hey, so what's up with the weather? Well, we are going to have partly cloudy skies, mild temperatures, around 50 degrees. Did you know that this time of year, 50 degrees is the average? At WPSD, we don't just talk about the weather, we report it. Hi. I'm Alexandra, a student from the Western Pennsylvania School for the Deaf. Recently, Stephen Cropper, a meteorologist from WPXI-TV, showed our science class what is involved in producing a weather forecast. He gave us good advice and taught us a lot about predicting the weather. We got really excited to produce our own weather report. We use radar and we can actually zoom in and show you if a storm's coming. So this is for rain, snow, I can show you wind, I can show you a tornado if it's developing. And what we want to do is alert you to the weather that's going to impact you. We've been learning about weather at WPSD. We use the weather bug system so our students can gather data about the weather. Up on the roof, we have some special sensor equipment. We gather information like wind speed, humidity, pressure, all of that outside, and it's put onto the screen right here. And when we gather this information, then we can use that for our forecast. Now here, we collect a lot of data using different probes, especially related to temperature and wind. The data shows up on this map, for example, for temperature, the wind chill, the dew point, and humidity. How we predict our weather is based on looking at the pressure. If we see there's a high pressure system, it means there'll probably be a nicer day. If the pressure is low, well, it could be not such a nice day. It could be stormy or rainy, and the temperature could change as well. If you look here, you'll see we have a temperature map. Where you see the dark blue, that indicates colder temperatures, and where it's green, it's a little bit more mild, more like a coolish temperature. The next thing I'd like to show you is a localized pressure map. You see all the data points, all the numbers? That shows how much pressure is in any given area. Over here, it's mostly high pressure, and over here it's low. Using Photoshop or Illustrator, our students can use the information to create graphics for the news program. These images are saved and then we import them into our CG, our graphics system, in the TV studio control room. There, they can be used with our chroma key wall. Then, we go on the air. Our weather report is ready to be shown all over the school on our TV system. We show it during lunchtime so we can plan our day. Wow, the weather is so up and down. It's beautiful and then it's awful. What's up? Oh, awful? Okay, well, let's see what's up with the weather report. Hello. Today's going to be a beautiful day. It'll be sunny with a high of 62 degrees. Right now, humidity is at 54%. Pressure is at 30.17. The dew point is 26, and the wind is out of the south southwest at 8 miles per hour. High pressure will keep the skies clear and rain out of the forecast. If we look at the rest of the week, we see tomorrow will be a little cooler when some clouds roll in. But we bounce back with temperatures heading near 70 by the weekend. Look at Friday, 70 degrees and sunny. It's just wonderful. Thanks, ladies. Back to the desk. We're so happy we can provide the service to the school community, but WPSD also serves the wider Pittsburgh community. 
by participating as a reporting station for the weather in this area. Hey, good Friday morning, everyone. Beautiful day. Temperatures already mild. We're rolling into springtime with temperatures at 47 now in Pittsburgh, a little bit cooler to the north, 45 in Butler, 45 also as you travel up towards Indiana. Thanks to our friends at Western Pennsylvania School for the Deaf in Edgewood for giving us the temperature. Right now it's about 45 near them. Using STEM at WPSD, we are able to combine classes and work together with students from different subject areas. We are getting great experience. Now, if you ask our students about the weather, it may be a long conversation. Thank you.